Look at it. Yeah. Yes. It is what I wanted. So I was gonna come tomorrow. So I'm excited that it came a day early. Um, but I think in the last clips you saw, I got a new phone. It's the Samsung S21 FE. I always get last year's model, basically. I got it in this purple color, matches my nails. Kind of needed some cases. Uh, so I got, ooh, okay. I'm excited for this one. Bit <laughs> sparkly. That's going to bring me lots of fun for a few days. And then I got uh, this one. It's got lemons on it. Cool. And then obviously some um, screen protector. So I, I'll try to be putting that on. And then a little notebook. I wanted something like a language. This a notebook for me to keep track of my language learning because yeah so I got this orange color so exciting so glad we did this okay bye Awesome. <laughs> Show it. But it's my diploma. Just like that, I've got not one, not two, but three diplomas. This is my favorite one so far though. Okay. I didn't expect her to see my diploma today, but I am very, very happy, literally. Oh, 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 it's official. I have a bachelor's degree, finally. Oh man, okay. Oh, that's so, oh. <laughs> that's, oh, well, yeah, no, mm-hmm. That's good, that's a good day, that's a good day, that's a good day. This vlog, I guess, is just gonna be a bunch of unboxings because, uh, another box here, though. Honestly, I did kind of open it, but I'm not gonna lie. I was surprised it came. Like, when I ordered it, it was kind of like, oh, it's processing, you'll get more information, um, if it comes or something. And then all of a sudden, today, right before we left, my mom was like, you got a package, Carly? And here it came. I had absolutely no notification that um it was coming so yet another phone case look how pretty it is i admit i've been using this one because 
the glitter hauling makes me happy um, and the pink color makes me happy and the fact that I can see my purple case makes me happy literally the fact that I have a pink case on a purple phone is like my childhood dreams coming true not that I wanted like a purple phone as a kid but like pink and purple are like my favorite color growing up um, and pink is my favorite color now and I like purple a lot still and so to have the two together just makes me feel absolutely girly in the best way possible but let's you know let's let's see how this new one looks what is that scan to verify maybe later let's see if I can get this on okay that's a pretty cool good case okay I do like that and you can still kind of see the purplishness of it and I did also get a one that um had sort of the same color scheme on it but I also just like flowers but I wish I wish this had texture I really wanted this to have texture it doesn't okay well that's it there we go very exciting phone case unboxing love that for myself all right it's late <laughs> well late for me about 10 15. I just got home but I got one more package I'm so excited for this one so let's open it because I know exactly what it is and it's been the one I've been waiting for the most I need my mom to make up a decision okay basics what I got here is it looks like I got like an iron box all right no Anyway, I got this one, and then I got this one, and then yes, there's two in here. Oh my god! <laughs> Bang chum and I in. photo booklet of the memories. Ooh, is that the lyrics too? No. That's just links. Okay. Just a photo booklet. I like that. I, I don't know what this is. I got it. It's like, it's filled with more cards. More cards. I think it's, it's all of them. Just doubles, but um, Tongbin and Hon, um, Mino and Bongchan. I know. Felix and Hon, and Bongchan and Hon. Okay, okay. Okay. And then I got more. <laughs> got the Hinjin and. Sumin, who's a literal maniac according to this, and Han, and then it's a sticker sheet, and okay, cute. Just a little. I like that it's a group one. The GOT7 one was just a Jackson one, but I like that this is a group one. This is the lyrics. Oh. I got a giant token. Okay, that is way more 
than I thought I would ever get. Like, I was not expecting to get this much shit. <laughs> I'm very happy with it. I'm very pleased. This is a good one. And I am so excited to put this next to my GOT7 one. GOT7. Ooh, ooh. Those two are gonna look so good together. Okay. Thank you. Did anyone else graduate from college and then their college sends you a um, investment self-help book? Because my college did. Uh, <laughs> I, oh wow, this is, I, was, I expected this to have small print. <laughs> that, that's not small print. That's pretty big print. Listen, I know I was an accounting major. Um, but wow. Okay. Anyways, uh, I traveled around Europe for a month and I come home and I came home to this. That's not what this book video is about. I don't know what this video is about. But I did spend 30 days, a whole month, traveling around Europe. Went to many different countries. Maybe I'll make my own, I'll probably make my own thing about that. Lots of fun. Second time with this tour company. Definitely recommend for like that 18 to I think 35 year old now then that's not sponsored I am not big enough to be sponsored by the time I get all these videos out it's gonna be like one after another while the fact that I've filmed all these videos with many 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 weeks in between but um one of the cities we went to was Amsterdam and um with this company that in each main big city you get a local tour guide guided tours by local tour guides. I hope that makes sense. Um, and the one that I got in Amsterdam, and I say I got because we were a group of like 30 people, and so the in Amsterdam there must be some rules or something along with it, but they had three tour guides. And the tour guide I went with, he, um, his wife owns a sustainable slavery free chocolate shop like but I'm pretty sure it was called cacao and spice in Amsterdam and I'll put some more information around here when I find it but super nice people super cool they let us do tastings um, because we were all like hey dude we want to find your wife's chocolate shop and so after our official tour he was like okay mini tour 2.0 let's go and took us there and so I bought some chocolate and then I went to go and try to eat some of this just right now. And I was like, oh, why don't I make content with it? <laughs> okay, why don't I try these chocolates? I got um, two white chocolates and two like milk chocolate ones here, actual chocolate ones here to try. So I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna start with the one that I was originally gonna start with, which is this one. Pretty, yes, yes. Um, yeah, all in Dutch. I don't know any Dutch whatsoever. So I'm not even going to attempt to like say anything about it. All I know about this one is that it is a lavender chocolate and I like lavender floral flavored stuff. So obviously I got it and I'm going to try it. Oh, I can't see it, but it's so cute because it's like a little book and it opens up and then you get your chocolate. I don't smell any lavender. I don't taste any lavender. It's definitely a dark chocolate. This is 72% craft chocolate. No, that's good. It's still chocolate. Maybe I heard wrong that this wasn't lavender. Really no idea. Like I said, it's all like in Dutch. I don't know that language. But it's good. Um, one of the things they had is taste. Like I said, they they did a little sampling for us. It was dark chocolate. It tasted so much better than any of that like Hershey dark chocolate that you can get. So I'm really not mad at this. Okay, whatever. This is a dark milk chocolate. And I'll tell you a little secret. 
but I've actually tried this one before. Not that I specifically opened this package, though it is already open, but it's been also sitting in a bag for like a month. Um, see, kind of open, but it was actually one that they let us try. And I remember it being super delicious, which is why I got it. Mm-hmm. 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 Finish that piece later, but that's good. You can get your hands on this somewhere. Somewhere. You should get it. It's it's really good. I really enjoy it. That one's so good. It's so good. Next one we'll do this one. It says it's white caramel. It's like a white chocolate caramel one. You can get this open without absolutely destroying the packaging because these packages are done out so nicely. But this one doesn't seem to be coming off as nicely and easily as the other ones. Just ripped it. I don't want to rip it. It's just tough. It feels like it's, it's not white chocolate, but that's just more packaging. There we go. It's really cute. So it doesn't taste nearly as rich as like typical white chocolate that you'd probably get. Like I'm talking like a white chocolate chips kind of thing. It doesn't really taste like that. What did it say? Caramel? But you definitely get that caramel taste to it. Like a little bit. But again, it's not that overly sweet caramel taste. Pretty good. I would recommend. There we go. And then the last one I got is this. It's a coconut white chocolate, they said. And vegan. A little vegan. Vegan, vegan. It says notes of sweet coconut and white chocolate with a hint of lemon. That's probably going to be the best description of the song that I can give you. Do not savor. Oh, do not eat, but savor. And that gives a little, little thing on how to enjoy their chocolate. How they think it should be enjoyed. Okay, could already tell. But there's like two little... I am holding this upside down, yes. Thanks. Oh, I smell that coke. Mm-hmm. I mean, obviously, I can taste that coconut. I'm very pleased with that. And that little bit of lemon. Not a lot, but it's kind of like just there. I could be talking out of my ass. Okay, anyway, those are good. Very pleased. It will take me forever to eat those if I actually do finish them. But they're good. I could have bought all that show. I could have bought everything in that store. That's what I meant to say. I swear, uh, this is not gonna become a K-pop album unboxing channel. Um, I just happened to keep buying K-pop albums recently. I can't help it that all my faves are literally coming out with stuff. Well, anyway, welcome back to another K-pop unboxing album. Uh, album unboxing. Uh, I have a couple others coming, oh my god, um, but they're sort of pre-orders and such, so I won't get them for another couple weeks, and I really wanted to, like, unbox all these all at once, um, but to make a long story short, I've basically been waiting for this one for over a month, and, yeah, no, what happened was I couldn't decide which version I wanted to get, and then I left on a month-long trip, and I didn't order any, and then I ordered it when I got back, so it's here, I didn't want to wait another few weeks to unbox this. So we're gonna box it. And I got stickers for an icon album, mini album. Unfortunately, I don't really know icon. Okay. What I did get though is on and off special mini album, whatever thing this is. And it's it's very pretty. 
storage and on and off. And if you don't know who on and off is, I'm not surprised, but you should probably go and check them out. I would highly recommend because I'm only buying albums of groups that I really like. Okay. And the reason I couldn't make a decision was because they had this $40 one, which I did end up getting, um, and like a $20 one, but like I wanted the actual like CD and I could only get that with this one. Um, so I guess I paid $40 for a CD. Let's see what I got. Oh, so I got a binder clip. And a keychain again. Okay, it's like a little diary. So yeah, you get the CD, which is literally right here. It's, okay, kind of odd. And then this whole oh, there's there's those goodies. It's like a yeah, it's like a straight up diary. There's like pages um, with pictures. Cause here's a picture of you. Okay. And then, oh, those are cute ones, but okay. So that's. Pigeon. Okay, cool. Just pretty standard, I would say. I have a place to put photo cards in here. <laughs> How'd they know I needed that? I will say, I'm really excited to have this because they did remastered versions of some of their songs and one of my all-time favorite songs of theirs is Complete, which is on this album. And so I am very, very excited to have that. And not to mention it was a good, this was good, this was a good mini album, especially since it came, since they're all um, enlisted right now, so like, I was not expecting to have any sort of comeback while they're, literally all of them are enlisted, except for you, because he's Japanese. Um, but, uh, yeah, they had a comeback. Well enlisted. It's weird. It's wild. The goodies. The stuff I think we're all excited for. Now I am. I got a little door handle. Of which... I know, some of this stuff is just so strange, I'm not gonna lie. Another thing I was kind of excited about. But I got a sticker sheet. Got a couple of stuff. I think there's... Is there one? There's two in here. There's two sticker sheets in here. They are really annoying me because honestly, I think MK is like my bias, my sort of favorite, and I got his um, boarding pass, then this ticket thing, and then I literally see the first photo card in here is MK. Is that from their debut day? That's adorable. I knew I was going to get some photo cards. It looked like from earlier ones. Other earlier stuff. So yeah, that almost looks like MK from damn okay. MK from um the on off um music video. And then I know what this is, but it's Wyatt from Complete. Okay, pretty sure that's Ishion. Cute. Because we've got you. Oh, it does tell me. <gasps> yeah, that is from the on off okay because it tells me on the back here cool and that's you which is super adorable and Huijin and JS so cute I am here for it would have loved to have more from the complete but I will take it in one of each perfect beautiful love it here for it wonderful okay thanks for watching I'll probably be back when the other ones get here. I'm so excited for this box. Thought it was, I was half afraid it would come last week when I was out of town. And it didn't. So, get to open it now. Yes. <laughs> this is another fucking K-pop open. K-pop album unboxing. It is another K-pop album unboxing. But 
for it. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. Damn, okay. Okay. Already, already excited. Got this little note that says, we hope all is well with you. We just wanted to thank you again for purchasing your With Choice Music. As a token of our appreciation, we included a free gift with your order. Um, what those gifts are, are this photo mark, which perfect, like, okay, back when Got7, back in May when Got7 was coming out with their album, when they released the single photos, this was my absolute favorite photo. Like, I think I just stopped. And then, and then, I was so happy when I got my Got7 album and I pulled this, which right now is currently in the back of my phone case, just because I'm going to see him on Saturday. And I was like, gotta be prepared. Anyway, so I've got that shot of him. Now I've got like the more official photo. And then it also came with, I seem to think I, and then, and then, that's exciting. Oh, the mark it's so exciting to me. So I got a little sticker. Oh, also, I just, I'm going right into it. But basically, I got an accident, because obviously, and the other side, because also, obviously. Um, but anyway, on top of that is, Jeez, I'm just getting all the... Got... I... Choice gang. This is even... Either way, this is another Mark one. I love it. So good. Is that Lino? Anyway, got that one. And then... oh, Oh, this is a holographic one. This is... <laughs> I ordered this one. Anyway, Chongbin. Look at the heart. He's adorable. Okay. Let's do, I'm feeling maxing first. Okay. It's just a little book. That is such a cool way to package this, I think. Ooh, okay. I am here for it so far already. Let's see, what is all in here for me to pull out? It's just a Chongbin box. Three Chongbins. That's that's so cute. Oh, and then oh, is this a little sticker or tattoo or something? I don't really want to open it. I'm gonna put the tattoo on me actually. Okay, this is this is gonna die. This is dying. We might have to move to the phone. Where is said phone? Okay. This is strange, but we had to move to the phone. Anyway. What was I was just about to open this, I think. I think it's supposed to be like a sticker or like a tattoo-esque thing, but like I'm not gonna put a straight get tat tattoo on me. Such <laughs> would be so ah would be so funny to put on me though. Oh my god, they were just like Carly, you get a Chongbin box. A Chongbin box. It's a Chongbin. But I mean, again, not complaining. I'm just finding it funny that I'm not getting much variety here. It's just Chongbin. I, had... I did get Han. Perfect. Love that. And then this is just the lyrics. And obviously I have listened to it all. And I think my favorite songs are Give Me Your TMI. Chill is pretty good too. We Can't Stop. Shumin Ayin. Yeah. Ayin. Um, yeah, so can't stop. Give me your TMI and can't stop. Can't stop is, is so good. Gosh, this is, this is so big. But it's fucking adorable. Does it fit? Does it all fit? Does it all fit? It's cute. We're here for it. Oh, and there's that. That, and then obviously, this is super cute. Obviously, I'm not gonna flip through it all, but little, it's like story time. <laughs> not even showing it. I'll look through that on my own time. After this, we'll text my friends saying that I got a Chongbin box. Put that sticker in there. Ugh. I'm still so, 
so excited and happy about this Mark one. I'm just, I, this was like literally my favorite. Okay, let's open his now. And yes, oh, ruined it. I knew I would. Oh well. Um, yes, I am seeing Mark on Saturday. And I am so excited. Like, I bought myself VIP tickets. And my friend just drove the I feel bad. But we got another friend to come because I have three tickets. Um, but if you know me, you know, that seven is like the group that got me into K-pop. It's like, it is my top tier. Number one ultimate group. I, yeah, that, that's not going away. And I've accepted that I'm like probably never going to get to see GOT7 as a group perform live. That's just how these things go. Unfortunate, but I've accepted it. So the fact that I get to see at least one of the members perform live, I am. I think I almost started crying when he announced his tour and that my city was going to be on it. Anyway, there's that. And there's a better photo of it. There's that. And it opens. And it opens. Lyrics and pictures. And I'm not going to lie, I was slightly worried I wasn't going to like this as much. Like, I bought the tickets before this album came out, and I was like, mmm. Because his, like, solo stuff so far had been miss, hit and miss, but I really like the album. Oh, these are adorable. Obviously, this is all going to be Mark, but these are some super cute Polaroids of him. I like that one. And then him being Moody AF. Still here for it. Sticker? It's a Sticker. I was like, maybe I'll take some of my K-pop stickers and like put them on my water bottle, but mm, that's big. That takes up too much space. Sorry, Mark. What poster did I get? I like that one. I do like that one. Very simple, but I like it. I like it. And then, oh, that's kind of cool. As you can kind of see. Well, actually, maybe not because it's such a reflection kind of thing going on here. But um, on the CD, it has the, all the track names around it. I don't think I've seen that before. But I also haven't been collecting CDs in ever. Never. Anyway, those are those. And now I gotta go text my friends that um, I got them. And I got a Jonathan <laughs> album. Anyway, thank you for watching. I I don't even know what to say. Okay, bye.